A lot of people were telling me when I first took a job on a ship that, you know, I was selling out or digging myself into a musical hole, but so far I really haven't found that to be the case at all. I'm really happy to be in a situation where I'm creatively free, I'm challenged every day, and my skills are really appreciated. So I've been a working musician for about 10 years now. I've been working on ships for two. I take this gig incredibly seriously. If there were one word I'd use to describe myself, that word would be professional. I show up early, I make sure I have all my stuff. Generally, I'm the first person there, and uh, I really need to um, give myself the time to, to get mentally ready um, and excited about the gig. I do a good warm up. My technique and my face have to both be in optimum shape. I never know what's going to be put on the stand in front of me. This is a sight reading gig, and it could be incredibly hard. One of the best things about the job is just meeting so many great musicians. It really challenges you to get to that next level. <laughs> Sometimes you just have a really awful day. Um, rehearsal's tough or the gig doesn't go well, you don't play up to your own standard, and it's tough on ships. It's a bubble. Uh, everything's magnified. You have to find a way to go back to your cabin, relax, uh, take some deep breaths, and just put your mindset back in the place where you are the best professional musician you can be. It's really important to use your free time well and to keep a clear head. You have a lot of time to just practice your technique and your scales and get everything sounding a lot better. So yeah, I guess I could see myself doing this forever. Thank <laughs> you.